Jackie was the obvious choice for, for me for this award. He's um, he's been uh, one of, if not the most inspiring person I've worked with closely since I've been in the Northern Territory. I think his contribution to conservation issues is is simply outstanding, and I think that it's it's not well recognised. This area we call Wealia country, and all the old people used to camp here to look after this country because this is a sacred site here. They wasn't allowed to um, cut down trees. They wasn't allowed to do, um, do anything stupid on them hill there, there to um, look after it properly. That's how I've been told by my family, people of this country. So that's where I'm speaking today to um, kind of keep control of this country. It hit me in the heart and I, that sort of made me really good and happy that I got something back to recognise Australia, this important to this land, you know, this country is important to all Australians really. I want to be able to be free to walk through this country, so is my family. So the four clan group, if, if they stay country, they should be able to walk around freely. I think that, you know, Jackie Green, um, along with a, a bunch of other Indigenous environmental advocates, should be a household name. I'm hoping that this award uh, for Jack will bring him some much-deserved recognition.